Hey guys, so great news is Samsung screen recorder is back for the Galaxy Note 10 and it's better than it ever has been in the past. Now, I'm going to show you guys how to activate it in a few seconds, but one major problem, uh, you probably already hear it by now. After about 10-15 seconds, we have this weird static sound. Um, it may end in a few seconds, but it's pretty consistently happens every time. Now, I'm not pressing the mic, I'm not covering the mic, it's nothing on my end. Um, so it's just a software glitch, but obviously it's pretty annoying and hopefully they'll patch it soon. Now for the UI, so you guys probably already see I'm drawing here on the screen. Um, you can't see it, but I have a UI right here in the top right corner. So for it, I can put on the front camera, for example, I can change the color for, uh, for the pen. And there's also a couple other minor features for it. Now, in terms of actually activating this, so what do you do is you swipe down. Now, at this moment, it's only this is only available for the Galaxy Note 10. Uh, I checked on the S10 uh, and some other Samsungs, but it's only available right now for the Note 10. I would think, based on previous Samsung updates, I think this probably will be available for other Galaxy uh, other Galaxy phones for the next couple months, but there has not been an announcement yet for it. So you guys see right here, we can end it uh, pressing on this red bar. And in terms of turning it on, all you do is you swipe down twice and then you swipe to the right. And you guys see right here, so I'm gonna show you guys something else in a second, but right here we have the screen recorder. Oops, actually let me turn back on pen. Yeah, so the pen's a little tricky here. Like in some situations, it doesn't work as well. But anyways, what you can do is you press on it once to start it up or you hold down on it. And now we have some additional options. So I think here I should be able to use the pen. Okay, yeah. So by default, it's on media sound. So I changed it to media sounds and mic. And by default, it's on 1080p. And you can also change the size of... Uh, the front camera, just gonna turn off the pen. So yeah guys, this is a pretty awesome feature. Um, in the past, you can only use this for gaming modes on Samsungs. So I'm glad they made this available for pretty much everything else. Um, you can't use it, I don't think for, you know, copyright stuff like Net Netflix, for example. But for pretty much everything else, I think it works pretty nicely. Uh, just need to fix this annoying very annoying um, sound glitch, but aside from that, it works pretty well. And to end it, all you do is you swipe down and you press on this red bar. So hey guys, thanks for watching and let me know in the comments below if you have any questions.